This section of central Kenya leaders say not even reports that the ICC is still gathering information on the Hay case could stop. Deputy President William Ruto from succeeding President Uhuru Kenyatta. But as the politicians spoke in Nyeri, the ODM counterparts asked Ruto to forget ascending to the presidency. And Oxycolia reports. <laughs> President Uhuru Kenyatta has four years to complete his final term at the helm of the country's leadership structure. But as the clock ticks, the debate over his succession is gaining momentum. Kip Kalyan, West Member of Parliament, was making reference to remarks by President Kenyatta that were interpreted to mean that his peak for 2022 State House race will send shockwaves across the nation. In Mount Kenya region, whether to support Ruto or not in 2022 appears to be a hot debate. Some Jubilee legislators have been pressurizing the head of state to declare the DP as his preferred man to occupy State House once he retires. The president has on several occasions dodged leading questions on his succession plan. But for some Jubilee leaders, there is only one choice. The wave of William Ruto ni kama hii mvua inanyesa siku ya leo. Hata ukijaribu kuweka mamvuli, mvua bado inanyesa. Kila mtu wanajua mambo vile inaendelea. Na wanajua ni nani wa kujua kupanga kazi, ni nani wa kujua kupanga maendeleo, ni nani wa story tu na hadithi na bure. Ama nyinyi muna mtachanganyikiwa kweli msijue nani ni wa kujua kufanya kazi gani? Sisi your excellency watu ya Nyeri, we have no business with the people we don't know. Sisi tunakaanga na wale tunajua, wanatutembelea. If it is working, don't fix it. We know that Jubilee is working. Hizo reporti ICC wanapokea. Hawazipokei kutoka binguni. Hawazipokei kutoka kwa mamba. Wanazipokea kutoka kwa watu ambao wako hapa Kenya. In its annual report published two weeks ago, the International Criminal Court says that Chief Prosecutor Fatou Benzuda continued to receive information relating to the post-election violence case that saw Ruto prosecuted at The Hague. But as the Jubilee MPs were backing Ruto, some ODM legislators were dismissing his chances of succeeding his boss in 2022. In this country, in the Republic of Kenya, there is nobody who has been a president who has never been an opposition leader. So Ruto will be in opposition before he ascends to presidency. So when Raila is the president, we will have him as opposition leader to help Raila also to run the government. It's only four years before Kenyans walk to the ballot in which the building and crumbling of alliances will keep changing the political scene. Enoxicolia, Citizen TV.